Aww, isn't he gorgeous? Oh, thanks. What do you think about the baby? Huh. Uh, sorry I'm late. Um, did you know that Emma was being left to organise this whole funeral by herself? It's not fair. Anyway, I was giving her a hand, so I lost track of time. Has somebody died? Who? Um, Emma's dad. Did you know about this? Yeah. How did he die? It doesn't matter. Uh, anyway, I'm sorry that How? I... Um, cancer. Poor Emma. Did you manage to do those lists? Oh, yeah. Uh, Daniel said you fancied a career change. That's exciting. Is it? Yeah. Did you make a list of everything that you fancied doing, everything that you thought you were good at? Uh, yeah, it's not really a page turner. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you'll get there. Mm -hmm. Right, bugger lugs. We better get going, haven't we? Love you. Love you. Say bye bye, Bertie. Bye bye, Bertie. <laughs> <laughs> Tour guide. Yeah. You know, like on a coach trip, stood at the front with a microphone, pointing out interesting things like old buildings, people's clothes. And you get to go to really nice places. Sorry. What? Had you not told Sinead about Emma's dad because of... Well, we can't wrap her up in cotton wool now, can we, eh? What's the pity? There's your coffee. Biochemist. Uh, yeah, I think I meant chemist. Who's uh, the person that gives pills out? A dealer. I mean, a pharmacist. Yeah, yeah, no, that's what I meant. Um, although, I think they always look dead brainy. I think you're dead brainy. Yeah, and they've got qualifications coming out of their armpits. Well, what qualifications have you got? Um, well, I kind of messed up on that front, you know, because of Nathan. Right. right. Who needs them, anyway? Me. I do. Yeah, but I bet that there's loads of CEOs and entrepreneurs that didn't get where they are by waggling their GCSEs around. Says the one who's halfway through his MA. Need to have more. Said so that you should aim big. A girl can dream, Daniel. But even I would draw the line at fifth member of Little Mix. Uh, I wouldn't need any rehearsals. I know all of the moves to a woman like me. Yes, but what is your singing voice like? Let's just say, Perry, better watch your back. Mm. Oh, come on. Showtime, Bethany. Hello, have you got a reservation? A uh, Lombardi, 12, 15, three people. Okay. <laughs> no! You want to have it out with him? Oh, yeah, because that's professional. Would you rather I let him stay? Should I go put a sign up outside then that says, Pedo's welcome? Sicko's early bird special, two for one on a Wednesday. Daniel! I can at least tell him to sling his hook. No, if you say anything, I will not forgive you, OK? Because you want to. No, let's just ignore it. Why? That's mad. So what do you expect us to do? Take out every person walking the street with a dirty secret? There'd be no one left. No, his wife, at the very least, deserves to know what kind of a man that she's married to. And his daughter. He didn't actually touch me. So what? He was just a voyeur, was no. he? Couldn't keep his hands off some of the other girls. Uh, he obviously needs to be locked no, up. No, Daniel. This has got nothing to do with you. Would you be happy serving him? Hmm? Exactly. I'm not going to let him win, OK? I'm going to go out there, I'm going to do my job. You can serve it. Are you taking the word of a complete stranger? <laughs> Get me the manager. I'd concentrate on my marriage if I were you. Right. Don't worry, the pervert's left the building. I told you not to say anything. I couldn't help myself. What about his daughter? What about you? I was handling it in my own way. You have no idea but how... Did it not give you even the smallest bit of satisfaction just watching his marriage go down the drain? That doesn't change what those animals did to me, and now you've traumatised his kid. That's on him. That's collateral damage. Where are you going Away now? Away 